Hi guys, hope you're all okay. Today I have, I'm going to share with you uh, what is in Ruben's Valentine's box or what's Ruben's Valentine's gift from myself and um, my husband. Uh, if you don't know, Ruben is our little boy. He is two. He will be three in August. Um, we do this for kind of every seasonal holiday for want of a better term. Um, so, you know, we do a Christmas Eve box. Last year we did one for Valentine's and Easter and Halloween. We also did one for the Jubilee um, just to kind of, you know, extra joy. I think if you can in inject extra joy in anyone's life, go for it. But you definitely want to do it for your own children if you can. Um, yeah, I apologise if I seem slightly distracted. I really enjoy making these boxes for Ruben um, and I always get such lovely comments when I put these videos up but without doubt I always get one possibly two really nasty comments about my child being spoiled or things along you know I'm being brought brought into consumerism um, and that makes me a little bit sad it makes my heart sad that people you know if you don't like a video don't watch it um, I was raised you know I'm 40 years old, my dad always bought me a present for Valentine's, my parents always, you know, I had, I wasn't allowed to do, I always had presents at Easter, I wasn't allowed to trick or treat, but I always had, um, you know, sweets bought for me, and I was always allowed to dress up, um, so it's no different to what my parents did, did for me, they just didn't put it in a box, but I already have the box, so here we go, it's not staged very prettily right now, um, because I'm trying to get this done before Ruben wakes up from his nap. So apologies that it doesn't look too pretty, but I'm just going to show you what's in it. It's the same box we use for everything. We got it from Etsy. It's got his name on it. You can get them everywhere. If you are cleverer than I, you can make one. There, I think it's the works sell a kit for you to make your own, but I bought mine from Etsy when Ruben was months old. <laughs> um, and, you know, he's almost, he's going to be three in the summer and it's still going well. Right. Done enough rambling, let's show you what's in here. First thing I'm going to pull out is a t-shirt. Um, I think he'll probably wear this. Um, maybe Valentine's, maybe. The, we're still not sure. Um, I think we're going to give it the, the box to him maybe the Saturday before Valentine's so he gets a full weekend and we both get to see him enjoy it because we'll be at work on actual Valentine's Day. But yeah, I got this from Etsy. It's a T-Rex. Ruben loves dinosaurs. Um, it's like, what does a dinosaur say? Rawr. What does a baby dinosaur say? Rawr. Very cute. It's his best joke. Um, but it's uh, I steal hearts and it's a dinosaur with red sunglasses on stealing a heart. Um, I got this from Etsy. It was like, it says Heavenly Handmaids on, on the label. Super cheap. I think it was like £7 with free delivery. Um, and yeah, it's not... It, yes, it's hearts on it, but if he wears it after Valentine's Day, it's not screaming Valentine's, is it? Uh, the other item of clothing, I got him these pyjamas. Um, they were from Asda. They're super cute. Um, and it says, you are so loved on the bottom. Um, you could get a family set, uh, but there were none left in uh, curvaceous mama size. Um, but yeah, I got Reuben these. I think they're super cute. Yeah, that was Asda, nine quid. And obviously, pyjamas can be worn forever. Um, a lot of sweeties. So we got these Bobito fruit hearts. Uh, I got these, I think, from Home Bargains. I think the whole bag was like maybe a quid, maybe a quid 50. And there's um, mini bags in there. Obviously, he won't get to eat them all at once. But yes. Some little sweetie hearts uh, and then I've got a bag of love hearts um, mama will be helping him eat those <laughs> and the one thing the actual sweet he'll probably enjoy the most I got these marshmallow hearts these were from pound shop these are from Poundland um, Ruben loves a marshmallow uh, we got a little chocolate heart lollipop Obviously, he will not be getting to eat these all at the same time. Um, 
to be honest, Reuben would probably rather eat a lump of cheese. Um, and then I picked up some love bugs and some chocolate hearts as well. So yes, very cute. Uh, we got a little duck. I can't remember if this was from Home Bargains or B&M's. I can't quite remember. It says quackers for you. Thought that might be cute for his little bath. Um, this fun little man, because of my silly camera, the white writing's back to the front, but it says adorable son. Um, uh, this was from the card factory. I just thought it was really cute and it's so soft. It wasn't, it wasn't an expensive, an expensive one at all, but it was, I was just impressed with how soft it was. So yeah, I got that and I was going to buy him um this i saw this very lovely um like valentine's coloring in book and I, I was planning on getting it and then i kind of left it in my basket on etsy a little bit too long and then clearly some other people saw it and the price went from 3.99 to 8.99 for a i think it was like a 12 page coloring book and i'm like nah so i went on good old baker ross <laughs> And they have a whole section on the Baker Ross website where they have free downloads of craft and there's craft projects and colouring in and you just download it and print it and it's free. Um, and they had a little Valentine's section. So there's like a dinosaur with a heart, elephant with a heart. What else do we have in here? Um, there's like some heart colouring in bits, butterflies and hearts, you know valentine's themed coloring in so we have that and then at the works they do that amazing book deal where it is you can buy 10 for 10 pounds or three for five pounds they only actually had two that was kind of loved themed so i bought three because reuben's best little girlfriend um he's made her, made her a valentine's card um and i bought her one of these to go with it so yeah so but we've got all we need is love and it's all about these like teddy bears the illustrations are really cute um and yeah it's just about what if each morning you shouted surprise and gave me 10 gifts when i opened my eyes but just look how cute that is yeah it's all about love and things and then the other one I got, which feels very much more like Reuben, because it's got a cheeky little boy on the front. And uh, Reuben is a tornado of uh, cheekiness. Um, yeah, and this is so sweet. And it's called, I love you just the way you are. Hello, Bridget Jones. You love her just the way she is. <laughs> um, but yeah, just adorable illustration again and Reuben very much likes to be read to he very much likes to turn his own pages um and for example if we did this page one I've picked at random it would be like sheep and he'd like to tell me what noise the sheep makes and the monkey and the dinosaur we're very good at that kind of game he's only two we can't obviously he can't read but he likes to tell you what's in the pictures um, but yeah, the illustrations are lovely. And that is what's in Ruben's Valentine's box. Um, I have ordered him a Valentine's card from Etsy um, with Bluey and Bingo from the cartoon Bluey um, on. It's not come yet, but I've got everything crossed that they're going to deliver. It's personalised. It's just got his name on. Um, but yeah, I'm just really hopeful that comes in time. Not that he will care. <laughs> just put it out there Reuben will not care he's two um it's all about the pressures that our, us mums put on ourselves really I suppose isn't it but yeah that is Reuben's valentine's gift from me and his daddy um I hope you enjoyed the video if you did please give it a thumbs up apologies for the ramble but you know the brain is already processing comments being negative about something else I've said um, it's just really horrible to go on someone's video and say your child is spoiled. He's precious. Um, and I suppose every parent would like to 
let their kid know how precious they are and um i am one of those people that what is it my love language is gift giving so it it's it's who i am i'm afraid but yeah that is my video i hope you are well take care guys i'll talk to you in the next one bye